So this video is for identifying the chords in your left hand from the beginning of the piece up to the end of the third line. I'm going to write it in like a bright pink so that way you can see it pretty well. So the first is G, B, D. And that's going to be the same. The same chord. So it's a C major chord, C, E, G. And the next measure is the same. We go back to what we played at the beginning, G, B, D. You can't really tell it's a G. And then that's the same as the next measure. This is just a C major chord, but you're playing one note at a time. So it's not blocked, it's broken. This is very close to a C major chord, but it's a C minor chord. So C, E flat, G. And it's the same for the next measure. The second line goes back to a G major chord, G, B, D, and it has the same notes in the next measure. This next two measures here, you have a B, E flat, and F sharp, which is really just a B major triad because the E flats and harmonic is D sharp, so B, D sharp, F sharp, it's the same thing. Just written a little funny. And then we're going to play each note by itself, but it's the same chord as here. Don't forget the F sharp, it's in your key signature. And we go back to a C, E, G chord. This is the same thing as a C major chord, it's just inverted, so the C is now on the top. D, F sharp, A, don't forget the F sharp. Same thing as a D major chord, but now the D is on top. G major chord. G, B, D. And here we have a B, a D, and a G. It's the same thing, just inverted. We have an E, G, B. E minor chord, same thing as this, but the E is now up top. C major chord, same thing as a C major chord, just inverted at the top. D, F sharp, A, same thing, but it's inverted. G, B, and N, E. E minor, E minor. Now here you have an F sharp, an A, and a D. I'll write it underneath. F sharp, A, D, and then you're playing an F sharp by itself, an A by itself, and a D by itself. So now you have a broken chord and the blocked chord. Don't worry about that yet. Just the top.